Hey there, this is Markus from FWSIM. In this tutorial we will go over all the steps needed to plan a drone show using DroneTech and FWSIM. DroneTech is a French manufacturer of drone show hardware and software. One of the ways to create DroneTech shows is by using their Blender add-on. Blender is an open source 3D animation software. To start planning our show we first need to install Blender with the DroneTech add-on if we haven't already done so. You can find detailed instructions on how to install and use the software via the first link in the video description. Should you encounter any difficulty with this step, please get in touch with DroTech. Once we are happy with the show design in DroTech, the next step is to export the show to use it with FWSIM. To do this, we first click Export VVIZ in the DroTech add on to create a VVIZ file. Then we switch to FWSIM and create a new file. Click Show, Import VVIZ Drone Show and select your file. You will notice that FWSIM has created a firing position for every drone in the show. You can now add single shots onto drones. You can also place fireworks on the ground. The new Smart Clone feature might be useful if you want to place a lot of cues on many drones. Create one shot on one drone. Then right click and select Smart Clone. Activate multiple positions and filter by position name. Then enter Drone as the filter term. That way your shot will be duplicated onto all other drones. You will probably need to export drone shots and ground fireworks differently. Drone shots are exported back to the DroneTech software, ground fireworks are exported to any of the firing systems supported by FWSIM. You can perform automatic channel assignment and export a script using your ground firing system. This only affects the ground shots. Shots on drones will not receive channels through the firing system and they will not be exported into your firing system script. We are now ready to export those drone shots to the DroneTech system. To do that click export, export VVIZ pyros on drones. This VVIZ file will contain all the pyro cues to be fired from drones. It will not contain drone movement. Switch back to Blender. Click light show, fire, import. Select the newly created VVIZ file. And that's it. Your firing data is now included in the Blender file and can be used to trigger cues on the DroneTech drones. Please note, if your drone show starts at a time later than 00 in the FWSM timeline, the times that are exported will be relative to that. For example, if your drone show starts at 010 and you have a single shot at 030, then the single shot will be exported as 020 in the VVIZ file.